Down block offense, down block counter offense. I really want us to, to develop this stuff so it's just second nature when the season comes. So we're gonna start basically, we're gonna actually change our lead leg, okay, and we're gonna mirror our opponent. You know, in the past we've always talked about don't change your lead leg, keep one lead leg forward, get a specific tie, okay? Now we're gonna open it up and open up your wrestling and open up your brain. So I'm going to go here and I'm gonna have a down block arm. I can post with my back hand, but my down block arm's gonna be here. Basically, I wanna catch him with my elbow and my hands in front. I can switch and I can go the other side, okay? So Jet and I are just gonna mirror. So as I change lead legs, he's gonna change the down block arm. So I go here, go here, and then I go here, okay? Move with me too. Move with me. You can post me. You can trail in the arm. Post me. And sort of, and sort of uh, close the gap for me. Post, post, post with your post hand. Like this. Post. I go here. I post in there. I'm here. Post in here. Okay. And that's what we're going to start with. Just a mirror drill. You're going to match lead leg side. You're going to keep posting and you're going to keep your feet moving. You're closing the gap with one hand down, one hand up. Okay, makes sense? Do it, one, two. So we're actually gonna down block. We're gonna go left, right, okay? It's important that your, your partner takes a really good shot. Like, don't take a, a silly shot, take a good shot. And I want you to take a straight single leg shot. So I'm kinda shooting over my shoulder, just to teach the shot first. Okay, get the stance. I would shoot, I'm gonna step, kinda, kinda over my shoulder here. I'm gonna step and shoot right there into the, right there into the thigh, okay? I'm throwing my hands to the leg, I want my ear to touch, touch the knee. Now with that same shot, he's gonna down block me with a lot of force. Okay, so just down block first, and then we'll go from there. So I'm going here, I'm here, and I'm going to shoot, boom, right there. Okay, you got to do it, do it better than that. Like, don't just leave your arm down there and limp. Your arm is going to go boom, and you're going to, you're going to create a force, and you're going to match a force. Like, if he comes with a force, I have to match it with a force, right? There's a charge coming at me, i got to match that charge. I can't put my arm down there. He's going to go right through my arm like tissue paper. So I need to put some force into my arm. His leg's gonna go back. Notice he's not sprawling all the way. He's not sprawling all the way. So I'm here, I'm here with my shot, boom, right there. Okay, his arm's here. He could have a little hook with his arm right there. Okay, from here our first move, it's just gonna be, notice he's off his knees, his weight is on me. He didn't sprawl all the way down and extend his body. He's over my shoulder on the other side, he's gonna pull me right to my elbow. Boom, right there and go behind. He's come off his knees, his chest should come on the back. Let's do that again. Okay, so we're here, yeah, Ooh, right there. Now you gotta hit me harder than that. I really want you to stop me. Defensive person, get comfortable here. Yo, you're not blocking with your head now. You're blocking with your arms. You're blocking with your arms. Notice your feet have to go back. You gotta have this thing coordinated right here. Okay, so as I'm shooting, I want him to really hit me. Ooh, right there, and pull, and go. And you move really smooth. Now I'm gonna go left, right. I'm gonna go the other side here. Now, do it again. You gotta hit me with that. I don't wanna feel like you just get caved in. You've gotta match and stop them. You gotta match and stop them. Good force. So I'm here. Right here, go. Good. Good. So keep the weight down as you double block. It's just a down block, double block, go behind. Okay, that's the first one. Here we go. Do it right. One, two. Take this in phases. You're gonna down block them, you're gonna stop them, you're gonna use your hips, and you're gonna score. This is, uh, you gotta consider this offense, right? When we get comfortable enough, where we can go challenge the guy and he's gonna shoot. I'm like, go ahead, shoot. And you're shooting right into my defense. And you got a lot of confidence with your arms and your, and your down block ability. Your head is, is basically up. You're not down blocking with your head right now. So as I close the gap here on this guy, and he goes, takes a shot, go ahead. Right there. I'm able to stop him. And I want, I want you to shoot hard and I want you to stop hard. Don't shoot sloppy. Don't shoot wild. You're shooting like this, you're not shooting like this. So when I shoot, you're gonna go drag them, okay? So I'm here, we're moving, he should move with me. Maybe he's using that post hand to kind of keep me in distance. Okay, I'm here. I'm like, but notice he's not backing away from me. So this is, we're not doing it like this. Okay, I don't want you to move backwards. He's moving to me. Because he's meeting my force with the force. He's meeting my charge with the charge. So I'm here, right there. You should be harder. Okay, now from this position here, he's, he's over my shoulder with his hand. He's gonna go around my head and he's gonna drag. And he's gonna run to the hip right there. Notice he never went to his knees. He never tried to scoot around me. He never got slow, he never took the weight off of me. If you put your weight on the mat and you go around, they're just gonna get up and face you. Okay, so again, I'm gonna take a good shot towards the side. He's gonna hit me with the charge. 
boop, right there, and drag. Whenever he pulls, he can go right to the drag. Okay, he's going high on the armpit. Look how his hand switches over the head. Right here, he's, he's down block, his hand right there. Go back, right here, he's on the hook. He's on the hook, he's on the clamp. Go back, hook, clamp. It's just his wrist. He's blocking, he's putting weight on my hand. He's trapping my arm high in the armpit. His shoulder is shoulder to shoulder. We're shoulder to shoulder here. Okay, then he runs to the butt. Run, 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 run. His weight stays on top of me, behind the arms at the end of it. Behind the arms at the end of it. Okay, very simple. Keep it simple. Okay, down block, drag. One, two. Make sure you stop him with your hip. Don't let him into your legs. Like you're still fighting, it's still this basic down block motion here. My leg's going back, my, my hip can go down. You know, this is a, I'm hitting them. I'm, I'm making contact. I'm not like trying to, it, it's, you gotta think of it like offense, okay? I'm, a, I'm attacking with this, okay? So now he's gonna down block, and then he's gonna, instead of dragging his arm behind, he's gonna run to a cradle. He's gonna drag my head. So your down block becomes your hook, okay? So you're gonna set the hook, say so set the hook. Your hand becomes like, they're like this, do your hands like this, where your elbows are nice and tight to your side, and your forearms, are, your thumbs are together. Did you hear the words I used? Do your hands like there you go. Okay, right here, and you're here, and you're hitting with this, with these. So when I'm here, I'm gonna shoot. Come over here. I'm gonna shoot. Oh, yeah, right there. Now from here, I'm jacking in the jaw there a little bit. Now he's gonna run, and he's gonna run his head to my hip, and he's gonna drag my head with me, with him. Go, go, go. Run, 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 right there, right there. And he's gonna lock. He wants to keep the crook of his elbow locked behind the crook of my knee. He's gonna pinch his elbows together over here. Okay, pinch your elbows tighter. Okay, now he, he's gotta get me pinched up and keep my hand to my knee tight. Okay, now from here, he's gonna throw me to my hip, to my shoulder. He's gonna angle throw me, go. Right here, and now he's gonna pull the feet. He lets the knee pop out, and he pulls it and gets the pin. Okay, we can roll back edge with this and back arch too. And we'll do both here again. Watch it again. Come on up. New side. So I'm here. I take a shed inside shot. Stop you right there. And immediately he's going. Go, 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 go. Run, 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 run. Right there. Okay, go. Rewind. Rewind. Okay. He's going to keep this tight. And he's going to drag my head with him. He can take and even cross this foot over and run. Run. Front, right there. Right there. See that? Now he's perpendicular to me. Notice his head went to my hip. Rewind. Okay, as he runs and he crosses over, cross over, run, his head goes to my hip and his hip pushes my, his head pushes my hip away, which, let go for a second, back off, which brings my head to my knee. As he pushes my hip away, it does this to my body, and now my head's on my knee. So he's not using all of his muscle, he's using his body position to get strong here. And once my head's to my knees tight, I'm really weak. If I got this much space, oh, I'm pretty strong here. Once I get here tight, I don't have much strength. And it's easier to, to get the fall. Okay, watch again. So it's nothing different. You're just putting them all together. You're, you're scaffolding the skill. You put one layer on top of another layer on top of another layer, and you improve. Again, shot. Right there, go, go, go. Okay, I'm feeling right there. Now it's tight. Elbows are going to be tight. He's going to throw to the empty space. Bro, see right there, and he pulls his feet, and he presses me into the mat. Good, okay? We'll do the going backwards here after that one. Do it right, one, two. Body position's huge. You can't be loose and all over them. Remember, you gotta still defend your legs. So if you start like crawling on top of them, they're just gonna grab your legs, right? You still gotta stop them with the down block. Come back, Jack, come over here. So when he shoots, and he shoots, boom, right here. I'm gonna run, so if you get like this, he don't grab your legs. You don't grab your legs and drive right through you. So you just have to be here with your body position and your shoulder. I've stopped him, I'm on the shoulder, I'm immediately cross them. And I want you guys to go ahead and grab the heel. Okay, that's gonna trap him. Okay, so if you get to the knee, he might be strong, he might stretch you out and square up. So once I stop him here and I'm here, it, this is tight. Definitely don't do this. This will, this is embarrassing. Don't do this, this is like a gift, it's an easy drag. This also takes away all your leverage. Your arms are short. Short arms and hooks. Say short arms and hooks. Short arms, short arms, short arms. Short arms and hooks. Say it again. Short arms and hooks. So my arms are short. I have hooks here. 
I'm off my knees. I'm gonna cross step run and I'm gonna trap his heel right there. Okay, now I can work up. I'm on my toes, my head's pushing. Look how shallow this arm is. If you're like this over him, like this, you're, this is completely wrong. Okay, I gotta be here, pushing, trapping, locking, locking. Now once I have a lock, I can put my knee down to set myself up to throw off on this leg. Okay, you go to me. Okay, freeze. Do it again. I want. I don't want you to circle with it. Go back, relax. Because if you circle, I'm gonna circle with you. I'm gonna circle with you. You gotta stop. Go. Stop me with the arm. Drag the head and cross step run and trap the foot. You gotta get out there. You can't scoot out there. Okay. You can't scoot out there. Do it again. And I want you to grab the heel. So I'm here. Shot. Cross run. Move right here. So trap the heel first, and then as you stop me, and now I'm like this, now you can lock up the cradle right there. Now, let's say I try to look, see, see how high his elbow is? I feel it already, like I might be able to get it, and I would like try to sit up here, like this, and try to fight this lock here, okay? He's gonna continue to walk your feet, get up on your toes, continue to walk your feet this way, until you can't walk anymore, now back arch, back arch, and sit. Arch the top and stick right there. Okay, so you want to walk those feet. Walk, 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 walk. Until you go here and you back arch and then you come back over and you find the cradle. I'll do it one time. Here, he's going to sit, sit up, sit to your butt. No, I'll just run you over if you do that. You're going to sit, like you're going to do the splits. I walk, 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 back arch, over the top, pop the knee out, get the fall. Okay, really hard to stop that one. Really hard to stop that one. Okay, have fun, do it right. So down blocking, this is down block offense. So you get, it, it takes you being able to have a high crotch on both sides too, right? So we gotta get com comfortable down blocking both sides, okay? Running to both sides, to score on both sides, but then also I'm gonna high crotch on both sides. So. For me, let's say he's a lefty, and I'm gonna go, I'm gonna match right leg lead here, and he's gonna shoot. I'm down blocking right here. Okay, now he's good, he's good. And so once I get here, he starts trying to retreat out of here. He starts trying to get up, come up out of there, and he come behind crotch off of that same down block. So I've kept the hook in there, and I just lifted him up and shot my high crotch. Okay, watch it again. My right on left side. He's going to hit right, he's going here, boom, right here. Now this is my left-handed down block. That means I gotta get into a right-handed high crotch. Cause I find the hook here, as he comes up out of there, he circles out of there, boom, I come right. And I just lift it up and hit my high crotch. Outside arm with that leg. No, just pull it back like it's thrown. Outside arm off that leg, my feet. That's my feet. You see it? Okay. For sure I'll throw it again. So, again, without a partner, if I'm righty, I go here. He's coming back up, I'm gonna lift and step in. I'm gonna follow here, I'm gonna follow him. As he retreats, big step, high crotch. Big step, high crotch. Just like Kendall's big step, high crotch. Okay, this is basically what he's doing a lot of the time off of his down block. So again, if, he's a, if he down blocks with his right arm, it's gonna turn into a left-handed high crotch. Okay, if he down blocks with his left arm, it's going to turn into his right-handed high crotch. If I go here, you here right there, and I start coming out of there, and yeah, you got to lift it. So you got to follow me. I go here, turn this side. I go here. That's what the chick is going to Lift, go right into an underhook. Yeah, lift it up a little shot, big shot. That's not bad. That's not bad. So your down block becomes an underhook. Your down block becomes an underhook. Make sense? So you're here, here, feet up, right to the shot. Down block here, feed it up, right to the shot. Do it one more time. And I, I want you to be able to do it on both sides. Even if you never hit it on both sides, I want you to, to drill this on both sides. So I'm here, I'm gonna go righty. And whatever leg, he just gotta match my lead. So you're practicing matching leads here. Practicing matching leads. Underhook, 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 underhook. Okay, other side.
Underhook, underhook, high crotch. Right there. See, he sort of switched off before he didn't pull and turn the corner. He just sort of slid to the switch off. Want to do that better, okay? Do it. One, two. 